And without much further ado, the easternmost islands of Kiribati in the Central Pacific have just stepped into 2022. Take a look. The country is the first in the world to welcome the new year because of its unique location right next to the international dateline. Our correspondent Owen Poland tells us more about this Pacific island nation. Around 120,000 people live on a series of 32 atolls and important celebrations are usually held under traditional meeting houses which are scattered across the islands. Feasting plays a major part in the Kiribati lifestyle and on special occasions like New Year there's likely to be roast suckling pig and crayfish on the menu along with traditional foods like coconut, taro and banana. The most popular drink is a sap collected from the flower of the coconut tree, which is known as toddy, and it can be mixed with water and tea or fermented to make alcohol. And while Kiribati is the first country to greet the sun every day, it's also predicted to be the first island nation to disappear beneath rising sea levels caused by global warming. On average, the Kiribati atolls are less than two metres above sea level, and many people now live on stilt houses well above the waterline to avoid storm surges which are flooding homes and killing crops. Two atolls have already disappeared, and some residents have become climate change refugees by moving to countries like New Zealand and nearby Fiji, which could become safe havens if the worst happens. So far, there have been no reported cases of COVID-19 on the atoll since the pandemic began. And surely that's something that has to be worth celebrating in a world where COVID has ruined so many New Year celebrations.